Hi everyone, welcome to Naresh Technologies. This is Srinivas. In this session, as we are going to discuss so what are the limitations of a local inner class? This questions. So, what are the limitations of local inner class? Local inner class is the question. So, we know that already what is a local inner class? Just defining a class inside the block or inside the method or inside the constructor is called a local inner class. So, here it is I am writing, I am writing one inner class inside the block. So, this is what we called a local inner class, local inner class and here, so now the discussion is, so what are the limitations of a local inner class? What are the limitations of a local inner class? First limitation the so, local inner classes you cannot access from outside of that block means what a local inner classes means what is belongs to a particular block or a method this so, means what the availability is so, nothing but the scope of the local inner class is inside that block only or inside that method only so if you want to access the functionality suppose there is a non static member and if you want to access if you want to instantiate, you have to create object here only, new local inner class. You have to instantiate, you have to instantiate a local inner class within that block only because the scope is belongs to a particular block. This is the first limitation, right? As a local inner classes means what not allowed to access from outside of that block. Second one we cannot apply access modifiers to local inner class private level package level protected level all these access modifiers are not applicable to local inner class sir why just remember so what are the limitations of a local variable local variable also you can access only within the block and access modifiers are not applicable to local variable why sir because suppose if it is a public level imagine can you access from outside no is a private or package or protected any level it is you cannot access from outside then why unnecessarily we are applying that access modifiers next one a local inner class cannot be static cannot be static suppose if it is an inner class inner classes can be either a static inner classes or non static inner classes but here you cannot apply a static modifier to local inner class reason so whenever the word static is means what uh, if you hear the word static in java is nothing but it's common and it's global for all it's a shareable thing but here it is it's a local inner class so right how can you say that it's common for all it is not available from the outside blocks in the same class and in the same application so here it is a local inner class cannot be static so, limitations are you cannot apply a static modifier to local inner class and you cannot apply access modifiers such as a protected, right, a public, private to local inner class and local inner class is allowed to access from only one block means what in which it has defined. So, these are the limitations of a local inner class. So, hope you understood well. For more videos, please subscribe to Narayshati channel. Thank you. Thank you all. Thank you.